you have to follow your instincts and you have to move when the energy is right. Everything on the external world is not what it appears to be. It's all an illusion. It's based on your thoughts, your emotions, and your behavior. That's what made the experience that you're experiencing right now, all right? In order to elevate past this experience. And that's literally your job here. You're not here to stay in one spot. You're not here to settle. You're not here to get comfortable. Trust me, you're here to move. This whole game is movement, momentum, powering through. Any problem that you occur here, that you experience in this 3D reality, is because you're breaking that universal law. You're literally not moving through the world as you should. And it's crazy because you can be experiencing a negative thought loop right now that appears to be a life situation that you just have to overcome one day and then you'll be wherever you got it. It's, it's not true, bro. It's not true. You can literally just walk your way to heaven. You can literally go inside, pack up everything, and move to another country if you really wanted to. If you really had the courage built within. But the simulation and the external world might continuously throw you off. So you got to power through it. And you can't stop what's necessary in order for you to grow. The things that are necessary for you to grow are going to be presented to you every moment of your day. Every single day you wake up. There's a new indication, a new wall that you're going to have to be presented with. And you're going to have to use your intuition and control of emotions to know whether or not you need to climb over that wall. Right. You know, like we're just using words, but we're talking about like that great big thing that's stopping you. You either climb over that wall. Right. You understand where your feet are planted and you move with with reason and purpose. You feel me? So meaning that you stop. You're looking at this blockage, you're looking at this limiting belief, this door that you're trying to get through, and the hasty, heady, you know, just keep busting all over yourself version of you. It's just like, I gotta do it. I just, how do I do it? You gotta calm down, bro. You gotta chill. You gotta follow your intuition. Your intuition say, hey, look, look, look right there. Look to the left. There's a little, there's a little hole, there's a little key slot. Yeah, but I don't have the key. I don't know how to get through it. Chill. Just check your pockets. Just look in your back pocket. And you'll be like, wow, it's right there, you know? And that's how this game works. You feel me? This entire game, like, we can't underestimate the universe because that's you underestimating yourself. If you're not in a place right now in reality where you really, 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 really feel like I'm right where I want to be, that's because you've been playing yourself. You've played yourself, bro, all right? A lot of this is based on looking at things and realizing that it's subjective and then there's like an objective way of life happening at the exact same time you feel me um the more objective you look at it the more strategy you're gonna have to have the more world with all you're gonna have more strength you're gonna have to have because you're literally setting your mind up to think that these things are outside of you but it's all subjective bro literally it's all subjective and your intuition your gut your instincts, your follow through, they're gonna tell you what to do next. Today is not always the right day, bro. Some days you're not supposed to be there. Some moments you're not supposed to say something. You're supposed to listen, you feel me? You gotta master these moments or else you're gonna keep busting nuts all over yourself. Stop underestimating this reality that you're living. You're in control of the whole thing. So how do you win? By realizing you're in control of the whole thing. You feel me? But there's requirements to reach levels. That's the only thing that I'm even talking about when I'm talking about the book of results, bro. Okay? You can literally come here and do nothing. You can just be somebody who, like, I'm barely on the hammock, you know? Like, you can be someone who just wants to vacation, live on the hammock. You know, like, be, be simple. Or you can be someone that looks at this as, like, duh, check mark. I'm externally where I want to be for the most part but you're self-aware that you have places to go. You have to get higher, you feel me? So it's just a part of the knowingness of your life, you feel me? And to everyone else, it looks like miracles. It looks like, you know, you're rich. It looks like, how did you do it? Blah, blah, blah. But you know that your instincts got you here and you wouldn't and you shouldn't be living any other way. You know, it comes with a lot of self-trust. And we're gonna be talking more about self-trust on these videos and I'm just going to be teaching you from every angle how to not fold on yourself and how to not fall apart in the simulation. There's people out there not even trying. There's people out there not even reaching. There's people out there. 
believing limiting beliefs and i swear your excuse is valid bro the reason why you're not where you want to be yeah it's valid it's valid but if you realize what i'm breaking down in every single video in all of my books if you realize that there's tools to level up bro you feel me so you can be who you are and chilling and all of that but you could do it in a in a high rise you can do it on an island you can do it with the view you can do it with the woman that you love you can do it with proper energy right you don't got to be it's like spiritual bypassing like you don't have to be where you are as if it's like some level that one day god's gonna bless. no bro the level's right there okay start looking around start doing less of all of the things that's keeping you from that level you feel me and just walk yourself right in the door like you have full access but your emotions your emotions bro it's embarrassing you your emotions are embarrassing you're like not maybe to everybody else because maybe you don't want to let your ego you know hit that hard but you know you could be doing better you know it's like about time you know that it's like about time you feel me and that's why i'm here i'm here as your reflection and i and i truly mean that by reflection like i'm literally just a, a figment of your imagination in your mind bro you drew me up you pulled me into this universe and gave you these messages to guide you along the way and it's actually a blasphemy if you don't follow through on these messages and we all know that this is based on your thoughts your emotions and your behavior your behavior is you now watching this video what's next you know this whole game is based on causality bro it's cause and effect these videos aren't just here for decorations okay you drew me up you pulled me into your frequency into your realm of energy right now and for you to not follow through on the message it's like you spitting in god's face for giving you the gift that you asked for you feel me it's like you asked for a car and it took you no effort you had to just click a button or the algorithm just showed you like hey here's your car it's free and you're like eh, i don't like that color i don't like that you said that i don't like the person driving i don't i don't i'm not into that car anymore it's like and god's just gonna be like okay like whatever you say you know and you'll get more of the other stuff you know and you'll get less of the transformation so that's what this is about following your gut for transformation so that you can master each moment that you're creating as it's being presented to you how do you know that you're mastering the moment because you feel really really good usually you feel a little skeptical you feel a little like it's not gonna work you feel a little like it's been a bit of a struggle right but no in the sweet spot you know that everything works so you act accordingly this is why your thoughts your emotions your behavior is everything to you and this is all that you should be focusing on throughout the day as you're moving through the world and this is why daily rituals are very important because by you having a ritual to watch these videos to listen to this knowledge to implement the audio books and to read the books that's thoughts being jammed into your mind via auto suggestion okay so there's going to be certain things that are unconsciously presented to you from your subconscious mind it's just going to draw up you know if you watch enough of my content you'll do certain things and you'll eventually start to hear me in your subconscious mind some of you you might even see me in your dreams you know if you watch enough of this and you listen it'll start to arrive and it'll course correct you so those are your thoughts you fuck with me right those that really do you fuck with me you listen to me you love me. You believe this. If you're going to use this, okay? You get attached to it. You feel some type of way. That's your emotions, all right? That's the light. That's the God in you. That's your consciousness. That's the spirit, okay? It's in tune with the thoughts now. It's one thing, bro. It goes idea, emotions, behavior. You understand? And before you know it, you will be doing things with your physical body. You'll be saying things. You'll be acting a certain way that is in alignment with the thoughts you feel me and the emotions so this is a strategy that you have to realize 
that you're creating as you go along. I feel like if you really did enough shadow work, especially the way I break it down to you, a lot of your life situations will go away. You can just start traveling the world, be who you wanna be, build your business, make your money, do whatever you gotta do in the simulation. More importantly, to raise your consciousness to a certain level where you're just transcending and you don't even care or need it at all. You know that you're good here. You're good into the moment that you die. That's what I'm trying to get you to, okay? And by being a part of my VIPs, by working with me personally, okay, we're gonna get you there quicker. If it's if you can, you feel me? A lot of people get presented this information and they're, they're not ready because they don't, it, it, they're not noticing that they're an NPC, okay? So we have to get your vessel. We have to work your mind. We have to pull that dark, lost, old abandoned traumatized negative energy out of you that's lingering in all of us right we got to draw out the shit and then we got to use what's left over which is going to be the shadow and then we integrate that okay into who we are right now making you a god body you feel me like literally living through and experiencing god consciousness and god frequency every moment of your life so that's what this video is about you understanding your instincts and moving through that you feel me click the link underneath this video to tap into my free community the inner circle where we go deep inside there i have my private classes we have paid classes i want to do uh, more private one-on-ones you know i don't really want to do too much groups but i'm working everything as i go along you feel me i just go with the flow i go with the flow but i see things way out you know so i'm um, tapping into the book of results underneath this video as well and do the prosperity ritual do the prosperity ritual that's underneath this video. Do it, just do the first ritual. Bro. You don't have to get all crazy and woo woo about it. Do the first one, do the first one. And I guarantee you, you will start to see the results that you need to see to know that this stuff works. You know, like, it's literally like that. Just choose yourself and you'll start to have more things be revealed to you as you go along the path, all right? So it's nothing but love and I will see you when you see me.